LBS Honey and welcome back to another episode of Where's LBS Honey's Mascot? The most popular series on this channel because I'm forever losing my mascot. But actually I love this mop dog and I think mop dogs need some more appreciation in the LBS community so can we just bask in her beauty for a minute? Ah! Okay back to the video. So I went down to my local news agents the other day and ba -ba 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 -ba, I found the new and improved Lilith's Pet Shop magazine and of course when you buy the Lilith's Pet Shop magazine you get a free toy which is this G5 giraffe. Ha! Oh my gosh I'm so excited and what I'm really excited about this is it says as seen on YouTube because of course they have like a weird little series going on on YouTube with these new generation pets but I think this could also mean as seen on YouTube as in the LPS community videos because they are quite popular and it's a big kind of selling point for Hasbro but yeah I was so excited to find this in store they only had two copies unfortunately I just grabbed it without really looking and mine is like all messed up with ink and it's like all over the stickers but it's not too bad so I'm not that worried and the pet is in pretty good looking condition so I'm really happy to have him and one thing I noticed is I think the UK version of this magazine came with a hedgehog but the one that was released in Australia came with a giraffe so I'm not too sure why that is if you can get this in America please tell me what pet you got because it'll be interesting to see if we get different pets depending on where we live but anyway, here's a quick look at the front. It says new look because of course it has the new pets and all the new bright, very 80s colours. It says you get a free toy plus 36 stickers. Then we just have some pictures and of course our free pet. And behind there it says welcome to poor Tucket. Here's all our stickers. And it actually folds over to the back where there's even more stickers. And how adorable is that dog? Oh my gosh. And the little hedgehog. Like, come on. These are so cute. And then on the back we have totally in love <laughs> which is pretty cute I do like her design and then she's also on the front because this is like the new main character of the little mini series and then behind the stickers we just have some more information like stories puzzles yada yada so I'm going to take this little guy off the front and we're going to open him up later in the video but like I always do with these magazines I'm going to quickly show you everything that's inside all the good information and prizes and competitions and stuff so let's get on to that Okay, here is our book and I took the pet off the front so you can have a little better look at the stickers on these side as well. I really love this little um, snow leopard, she looks so sassy. There's a little look. So, oh and there's a better look at behind as well. So, first page we of course have our introduction that kind of welcomes us to the new book. We also have an area we can write our name, age and our favourite kind of pet and also you can put a little photo of yourself as well as a little passport and then usually there's like a little craft you can do here and it's on the back page as well but for this one it's actually a little board game so you have little pets that you can cut out here and race them along. Then we have some puzzles so we have kind of a little word puzzle, a maze, just some little information here and there about some of the pets. We have a colouring, another puzzle, and then we have a little comic book. And they usually always have a little comic book in these. We have Sudoku. Then we have, I think this is another little game. Um, I think you're like spotting where these items are, I think. I'm not too sure actually. Oh yeah, you are. Because there is the little dog phone. And there it is there. So yeah, you must be spotting all these items in the picture. Then we have a big colouring in that you can do. And then find your perfect pet. So you answer questions and if you answer no or yes, then you move along and you get to find out who is your perfect pet. So fish, chameleon, bunny, mouse, cat or dog and holy cow, that cat is the cutest thing. Oh my gosh. And the little mouse has glasses. Ah, so cute. Then we have a poster inside, and they usually have a poster in all of them. Then we have how to make little lovebird nests. I think that's it. Yeah, it looks pretty cute. Um, we have a poor Tucket word search. And then I think this is another little comic. Yeah, that's cute. You can actually cut some of these pets out and have them on display, which would be really adorable. And then we have some little fruity animals you can make. Some more puzzles like um, spot the odd one out, little maze. 
And then we have a little uh, kind of maze, I guess, which is kind of weird. Use pets, I think. I don't know. Um, but then we have some competitions or contests, I should say. So it says there's 20 to win of the adorable adventures. Um, there's like a little um, prom set and a little tiki hut set. But unfortunately, because I live in Australia, we get these magazines very, very late. So to enter this, you would have to fill in these questions and all your information and send it to um, the address they give you here. But um, first of all, I live in Australia, so I don't think I can enter this because this, this is for the UK. And also, it's due by the 2nd of March, and it's already April, so yeah. I won't be able to enter these, but it also has some more products you can look out for, like the cruise ship and the Collect and Get Panda, which I think is finished. They did that years ago. Um, but yeah, so if you do get this in time, you can enter the contest to win these pets. And then the next page, they have an area where you can submit your own drawings. So they have drawings here by other LPS fans. And I believe if you send in your drawing and it gets picked, you win this pack here, which honestly I would love to win. These are adorable. But yeah, you draw your little pet here, fill in your information, and you can either email it or um, mail it in by post. And then on the back we have the rest of the little board game and also some advertisements about their other magazines they do. And then there's the back. So that is the whole magazine. I really love just looking through these. They're so bright and colorful and really cute to look at. And some of the pets are really cute. Like I really want to cut some of the pets out and use them to like stick up on my wall and stuff like that. Like how cute is that? But yeah, um, now that we kind of look through the book and all the little details, let's move on to opening that free pet. And I also actually have the official released version of it so I can compare it to the actual pet. So here he is, he comes in this very bright packaging and there's a little picture of him there. He's actually really good for a free pet, usually their eyes are a bit odd but his eyes look pretty good and he's very cute. And then there's a quick look at the back, it just has some warning and information on there. But yeah, let's open him up. So here he is straight out of his packaging and honestly this could actually pass for a proper official LPS that you know you can buy in store and doesn't come with the magazine. He is so cute. Of course you can't move his head, he is just like in this pose forever but his tail is really flexible so you can move that around. And yeah the detail is really awesome, he has all these little spots and he has really nice orange hair and his eyes are really well done. This one's been like printed on a little wonky. But honestly, you can't really tell that much when you hold him from a distance. So now that we've seen this little guy, here is his father. <laughs> so yes, this is the official released version of this giraffe. And honestly, doesn't it look like a dad and a son? Like, how cute. The main differences are, of course, the eyes. He has more green, where he has more kind of bluish aqua. He also has like a little um, kind of a gradient effect on his mouth where he doesn't and he has kind of mustard colored hair where the little one has bright orange hair also the ears have been painted on the official one and not on this one and just some of the colors are a bit different like his spots and tails and hooves are a bit different colors but honestly these two look so adorable together holy cow oh and of course this one has the little LPS logo printed on it but I believe they both have licensing on the bottom kind of hard to see but yeah there they are together oh and of course this one has a bobble head but they look so cute together guys don't speak to me or my son ever again wait is that still funny i don't know anyway thank you guys so much for watching and let me know in the comments down below whether you like the free lps or the official paid for lps better i think i like them both equally they're so cute together and i think honestly the free one could like pass for an official proper paid for LPS. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoyed my little unboxing of the pet <laughs> and the magazine. And yeah, it's really cool because they actually lowered the price of the magazine by $2. So that's really good, especially for us who don't want to pay a lot of money for these things. Um, but yeah, I'll definitely keep my eye out for more of the magazines and let you guys know if I find any. But that is about all. So thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and of course subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye guys!